Ladies and gentlemen, the American Jury and Bulldog Nation, everyone knows that the Courier Journal is a very liberal newspaper. Uh, they have opposed all the statewide Republicans year after year after year. Uh, their reporters are woke. Uh, Joe Girth, like works two or three days a week. He came up to the uh, Freedom Fest this year. It was hysterical. He had to admit that it was a large crowd. And then he like, a couple whack jobs that were there, he picked them out as opposed to doing a fair story. Joe Zonka uh, never, ever, ever writes one positive thing about my campaign or my candidacy, and because he because I'm a Trump guy, and not only that, he'll take the Twitter and stuff, and he's so funny, like he'll reprint something that I send him as if I care. I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and just tell all of you right now, I'm a cusser, which means that I throw in with the ranks of George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, John McCain. Uh, I can go on and on and on. I cuss. I cuss too much, but I do. And I stand by it and I own it. Um, so I, I'll, I'll tell him often, like, he'll tweet it out like I give a dang. But uh, I warned him. I w and by the way, if any of you have any information about Joe Zonka, Joe Girth, and these reporters. I like turning the tables on them, okay? Now what I've uncovered uh, about Joe Zonka is going to explain Joe Zonka and the Courier Journal. And it's this, Joe Zonka has listed uh, as uh, one of his prior jobs, oh by the way, news editor for Leo Weekly for three years in 2011, 2014. Leo Weekly is way left, okay? Managing editor of Amplify from 2008 to 2009. What is Amplify? Well, Amplify happens to be also connected to this group called Rewire News Group, Advocates for Youth. I'm a, there's, there's Joe Zonka, by the way. Let me read this. Joe Zonka is the managing editor of Amplify, the youth-driven community blog and online action center for advocates for youth. Amplify is focused on changing society's screwed up approach towards the sexual health of young people. Some of the stories, slutty girls and stupid boys. Today's abstinence only education. Obama's 2010 budget blueprint raises more questions than answers on sex ed. Eight months on, HHS still peddles abstinence only. This is for youth. Rewire, nonprofit, only national publication exclusively dedicated to reporting on reproductive sexual health and rights and justice. Sick, 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 sick. He tweeted, he by the way, he tweeted yesterday, he goes, the newest campaign finance filing of Eric Dieter showed that in the last three months, he received a grand total of $50. Um, uh, Joe, I am self-financing. I don't have to put the money in and spend the money until I use it. And you guys are gonna about ready to find out how much money I'm gonna spend. And that's just let me tell you right now, okay? The Cameron and Keck and Qualls are not gonna keep up with Eric Dieters and Kelly Kraft. Just so you know. This is the Bulldog. Every dog has their day. Have a great day.